he's getting better and better each week. You know, he played some in dime last week. He is he is poised and he's smart. He's ready for more reps. You know, so hopefully he gets more this week. But um, he was he was awesome last week. He played about I think seven or eight reps in dime, and he played well. He's played well. You know, he's played well, especially at nickel. That's a tough tough job. It's a combination of obviously corner, you know, uh, cover skills, some linebacker with run fits, you know, and you know obviously um, tackling. You know, he's he's a really good tackler. And um, when he's close to the ball, he gets it. Um, it. His his cover stuff has been really, really, really solid. His guys don't catch the ball, you know, and that's that's a nice trait for any defensive back. But he tackles well at the point of attack, and you know, he takes the ball away, you know. But um, he had a great spring, he had a great fall, but I didn't see this much of you know of his production being at high. I didn't see it. Galarian uh, Turner Yell, where's his game and how he's mm -hmm. come along? He's played for us, Mike, this year, and you know every week he gets better. I mean, this kid's tough, he's smart, and he's ready for the challenge. You know, and that's 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 their role. And and your hope as a coach, as the year goes along, those young kids are ready to play. You know, in the late part of the season, you're going to have injuries. You know, to the step in and play three or four games for us, that's their job. You know, Riley and those guys, and, and Jail Skinner, and Turner Yell. So, if he has to play, he'll play well.